Grilled bacon wrapped chicken wings are a real easy way to update your game day experience. They taste great and they're very easy to make. The day before you cook, take your chicken wing flats, dry them with paper towels thoroughly, and then lightly dust the wings with baking powder. Now, I like to use a shaker to add the baking powder. You lay them out on a cooling rack, refrigerate uncovered overnight. The baking powder will help us get that crispy skin that we're after. Also, keep in mind that using too much baking powder can change your flavor profile. Now, we want to season the wings with the barbecue dry rub of your choice. Now, I'm using my Pliant Hog Rub, and you can find a link to that video and the recipe right up here. You're gonna need one piece of bacon for every two of the wing flats. So don't use thin bacon, cause it'll cook too quick. Divide the bacon in half, now I split mine lengthways, and then you wrap it around the flat. Make sure that both ends of the wrap are underneath the wing flat, and you can secure the ends with toothpicks. It helps out a lot. Now go back and season the top of the chicken flats with just a little bit more of that barbecue dry rub. Preheat your grill that's set up with the charcoal over on one side. I cook these wings directly on the grates, and this way we can go in and out of the direct heat as needed. But my grill is very hot, and I kept the wings on the indirect heat most of the time. We have to turn the wings frequently. The USDA minimum safe internal temperature for chickens, 165 degrees Fahrenheit. I like to cook mine to at least 185, maybe all the way up to 200 degrees Fahrenheit. You can close the grill lid for a short period of time in between turning the wings. Use an instant read thermometer like a thermopin, and you'll always know when each wing is grilled to perfection. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. You'll always score with these wings on game day. <laughs>